My dear sisters and brothers, we are proceeding to a healing service. What we do is to claim, to claim the promise of the Lord. I will give you rest. Jesus invited everyone, everyone tired and burdened. And therefore this invitation is for every one of us. We are tired, we are burdened, we are burdened with many aches and ailments of the body. We are burdened with many painful memories of the past weighing down on us. This burden we want to offer in the hands of God today. And Jesus promises rest. I will give you rest, Jesus said. The rest Jesus gave to everyone, to every sick person who came to him. There's something so beautiful in the Gospels when the sick and the broken hearted came to Jesus. Jesus healed everyone. Not a single sick person Jesus sent back saying, I cannot heal you. I will not heal you. No. Jesus touched and healed. And Jesus justified this action of us. Jesus said, I am come for the sick. It is the sick who need a physician. I am come as a physician. Jesus again said, I am come as the good shepherd. What does the good shepherd do? The good shepherd goes in search of the lost, wounded sheep. And Jesus did go in search of the sick. Often we find Jesus in a hurry, going somewhere. There would be a crowd around him, but Jesus in a hurry. When we read the whole event, we would understand Jesus was going to a sick person who was waiting for him. The woman with the hemorrhage. This woman was waiting for Jesus. If only I can touch the tip of his garment, I will be healed, she said to herself. And she reached out and touched. And she was healed. The man paralyzed. Lying for the last 38 years at Bethesda. Jesus went to him and asked him, Do you want to be healed? The blind Bartimaeus in the marketplace of Jericho. Jesus was all the time very compassionate to the sick. And Jesus healed. Today, we want to wait for Jesus. We want to wait for Jesus 
to feel his touch the rest that jesus gave to the sick and the broken hearted is what we are waiting for all types of sick people came in search of jesus the woman with a hunchback jesus touched her and healed her the lepers considered a cursed group in those days jesus allowed them to touch him and jesus reached out and touched them and healed the blind the deaf the dumb the man with the withered hand the boy with the epilepsy all sorts of sick people and there is a sign whatever sickness you and i are suffering from today jesus is coming for you my brother my sister today jesus is coming for you but then we need to believe this the one thing that jesus demanded from everyone do you believe i can do this when we are sick we can become so desperate we can't expect anything good anymore we slip into self pity and despair a very wrong attitude we are in front of a god for whom nothing is impossible let's know this for sure and therefore let us tell jesus what martha said master i believe this nothing is impossible for you this god our god is coming to us let's put our faith in him an expectant faith an expectant faith is a faith that expects when i expect a healing from the lord i will be happy i have a great hope when i am happy i would rejoice i would praise god the one attitude we need to bring to jesus this morning to praise and thank god we do not want to languish in our despair anymore when my god is there for me why should i god is the almighty this expectant faith we want to bring to jesus today so far we were anxious about our sickness so far we were desperate about our sickness not anymore at this moment the one attitude of our heart is an attitude of expectant faith something is going to happen to me now jesus is coming let us all stand up and welcome jesus worship him and adore him believe in him and offer to him offer to him every ailment it could be a bodily ailment it could be a mental distress whatever that ailment is we want to offer it to him every worshiper brings an offering to god the one offering we want to bring to our god today is the offering of our aches and our ailments 
believing the lord is healing us the lord is waiting to heal us this morning let us sing together worshiping and adoring our god come now is the time to worship time to give you all come just as you are to worship come just as you are humble confess you are God one day every knee will bow still the greatest treasure remains for those who gladly choose you now come now is the time to time to give you love come just as you want to worship come just as you want to be confess you are God one day every knee will bow still the greatest treasure remains for those who gladly choose you now come now is the time
your Savior, it's your healer, it's the Lord who comes today. Call upon the name of Jesus. And Jesus, 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 we pray. We need your touch. We trust in your mercy and power. We believe in your compassion. We praise you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Praise you. Hallelujah. 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 Praise you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Praise you, Lord Jesus. Sanish. Winnie. Jacinta. Regina. Norman. Roger. The Lord is asking you, is there anything too difficult for me? Is there anything too difficult for me? It is the Almighty God who is asking this question to you. Is there anything too difficult for me? There are my brothers and sisters who imagine how can God heal me? The Lord is asking them, is there anything too difficult for me? Believe in the almighty compassion of our God. Jesus calls some people by name, but the message is for everyone. Let's all stand up. Continue to look at the face of Jesus. Continue. To look at the face of Jesus and reach your hands out to Him. Reach your hands out to Him. As the woman with the hemorrhage reached her hands out to Jesus, as the lepers reached their hands out to Jesus. Crying aloud as Bartimaeus, the blind beggar, reached his hand out to Jesus with expectant faith. Let's reach our hands out to Jesus and, and sing together, Lord, I reach my hands out to you. I open my heart to you. I trust in your power, in your compassion for me. Here I am, reaching out to Jesus, as mercy falls from heaven. Here I am, here I am, fighting my desire. As mercy falls from heaven, here I am, here I am, reaching out to Jesus. As mercy falls from heaven, here I am, here I am, fighting my desire. As mercy falls from heaven, here I am. This I know my God is for me, the Lord of all ages, through whom all things were made. May your nail pierce hand be upon me, Lord, as I place my trust in you. What can flesh do to me? I worship you, Lord, with all my heart. I 
Sisters and brothers, let me read for you from the Gospel according to Mark, chapter 1, verses 29 to 31. On leaving the synagogue, Jesus entered the house of Simon and Andrew with James and John. Simon's mother-in-law lay sick with a fever. They immediately told him about her. He approached, grasped her hand, and held her up. Then the fever left her, and she waited on him. The Gospel of the Lord. Prony Shalini Mini Renu 
Galia. The Lord is telling you what do you want me to do for you? A question the Lord is asking everyone. He's so concerned about your sickness. He's asking you, what do you want me to do for you? Look at Jesus and tell him. Tell Jesus what you want Jesus to do for you. The gospel today has a very special message to every one of us. Jesus was in Capernaum in the house of Simon Peter. As Jesus entered that house, someone told him about the fever of the mother-in-law of Simon Peter. Jesus went to her, held her hand, and raised her up. And she was healed. Then there is a little mention what she did after she was healed. He served Jesus. She waited on him. Every healing is meant for this. Every healing it's a manifestation of the Lordship of Jesus. Manifestation of the compassion of our God. Our healing is not for the sake of taking away our sickness alone. No. Our healing is for a purpose. Through a healing, God is manifesting His love for us. How much He cares for us. And therefore, through every healing, we know who God is. Every healing is a revelation. Who God is. Who God is for me. Who I am for my God. When I am healed, I realize how much I am loved, how much I am cared for by my God. When I understand this, I, I surrender my life to my God. As the gospel tells us, the mother-in-law of Simon Peter waited upon Jesus. Our healing enables us to serve God, to live for God. When God has intervened into my sickness, into my pain, I, I come to know who I am for my God, who my God is for me. I surrender my life to Him. I wait upon Him. I proclaim the name of my God so that God may be worshipped, God may be obeyed, everyone may turn to Him and find the meaning of their life in Jesus. Today, we want to make a contract with Jesus. A contract. Lord, I want to give my life to you. I want to serve you. I want to wait upon you. I want to surrender my life to you. Lord, I'm waiting. I'm waiting to experience your love. In my sickness. In my problem. 
so that I may know, I may know for sure who I am, who you are to me. And dear sisters and brothers, that contract of love we want to make with Jesus now. And we want to surrender. To surrender ourselves totally to Him. And surrender every ailment to Him. Every problem to Him. We want to surrender all our aches to Him. Let's all stand up. Let it be a moment of great faith. A moment our future is revealed to us. A moment God is waiting to tell us what He wants us to do for Him. Then we should wait upon Him. But before this, the Lord will manifest His power. The Lord will manifest His merciful love to us. Let us sing together. Down on my knees again, surrendering all, surrendering all. Find me here, Lord, as you draw. I'm desperate for you. I surrender. Reaching our hands out to I surrender. I surrender. Drench my soul as mercy and grace out for I hunger and thirst.
I believe, oh Lord, you are healing me now. Please be seated. Sujada, Blaze, Lucy, Frances, Alvin, the Lord is telling you, I am the Lord that healeth thee. What God sent centuries ago to his people Israel, That word, that assurance is coming to us. I am the Lord that healeth thee from the Holy Eucharist. The Lord is telling every one of us, I am the Lord that healeth thee. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Praise you, Jesus. Let's pray for others. For everyone in this community, all of us are weak, all of us are sick, all of us are burdened. We want Jesus to touch and heal us. Heal every one of us here and therefore let's open our hearts wide. The thing of all those who are sick here. Let's open our hearts still wider. Think of everyone in your family. Your children, your husband, your wife, your parents. Everyone in the family who is sick. We want to pray for them. We want to believe this. That the Lord is praying. The Lord is healing them. The Lord wants us to pray for a special group of people. Jesus said, pray for those who persecute you. Pray for your enemies, whoever hurt you. Certain faces could be coming up in your mind now. The people who hurt you. The people who wounded you. The people who tried to break your life. Pray for them. Pray that God's compassion may flow into them. Let's open our hearts still wider and think of all the people in the world who are sick. We don't know them, but Jesus knows them. And we want Jesus to heal them. And there are hundreds of people Having no one to care for. Having no one to pray for. We want to pray for them. In a very special way. To Sophie having. A problem of the back. An acute backache. Could you please stand up. We want to pray for you. To Sophie having a problem. Of acute backache. Maybe. Because of a prolapsed disc. Whatever could be the reason you have that acute backache. So, so we're having this problem. Could you please stand up? Also those who are having a problem of the shoulders. Because of the pain and stiffness of your shoulders. You are not able to raise your arms up. We want to pray for you. We want to pray for you that God's mercy may descend upon you. Those who are having a problem of the legs, a pain on the legs, a pain, a burning sensation under your feet when you stand up. 
so so if we having that problem so so we having a problem of the knee joints a stiffness a pain could you also please stand up we want to pray for you we want to pray for everyone standing up and everyone in the world who has similar problems we want to pray that god's mercy may descend from heaven and heal everyone standing up those of you who are sitting down raise your hands up raise your hands up for everyone standing up the so who are sitting down when you raise your hands up reach and touch a person standing up near you a person standing up near you touch in prayer touch for praying for that person for that person standing up for your touch he she may be healed remember jesus said when you when you visit the sick lay your hands on the sick and pray and the promise is the sick will be healed we want to claim this promise of the lord at this moment the lord is healing us healing every one of us here and very especially those who are standing up your problem your pain the lord is taking away there is praise god when i believe the lord is healing me i believe that god is doing this to me now and i i praise god i thank him for his grace being given to everyone standing up hallelujah hallelujah praise you jesus thank you lord thank you, jesus. Thank you, you are our jesus. savior thank you, you are our god hallelujah. jesus we trust jesus we trust in your power in your compassion of god we believe i believe you are healing everyone now we praise you jesus thank you lord jesus of mercy of mercy lord jesus thank you lord praise you jesus jesus praise you jesus thank you lord jesus praise you lord remove your hands and please be seated please be seated believing the lord's power is flowing into every one of us now so so we're having a problem of diabetes could you please stand up we want to pray for you so so we're having a problem of the eyes glaucoma or any other problem of the eyes could you please stand up we want to pray for you we want to pray that god's mercy god's mercy may descend upon you so so we're having a problem of arthritis could you please stand up we want to pray for you we want to pray that god's mercy may descend upon you so so we're having a problem of the liver or of the heart or any of the inner gland could you also please stand up we want to pray for you we want to pray that god's mercy may descend upon you those of us having a problem of the skin a skin disease could you also please stand up nothing is impossible for our god a god is waiting to manifest his power to us those of us having any other bodily ailment or mental ailment could you also please stand up we want to include you in our prayer that together all of us may experience god's healing power flowing into us those of you who are sitting down and standing up raise your hands up raise your hands up and reach out and touch reach out and touch one person standing up some of you having asthmatic complaint you also may now stand up 
reach out and touch one person standing up that your hands may be laid on him on her to pray that God's compassion and power may flow into everyone hallelujah hallelujah praise you Jesus thank you lord thank you for the savior you are the healer lord i trust I trust in your mercy. I believe. I believe you are healing me, O oh God. We praise you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Jesus, we praise you. We bless you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. 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 Praise you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Praise you, Lord. Hallelujah 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 all of you who was sitting down may stand up all of you sitting down may also stand up and we want to believe this that this is a moment this is the moment the power goes out of Jesus reaching us reaching every one of us and healing us Let's sing together healing rain showers showers of graces jesus said rivers of living water will flow upon you that's what we are waiting for but healing rain is falling down Even rain is falling down Healing rain is falling down Healing rain is falling down I'm not afraid I'm not afraid Healing rain is falling down Healing rain I'm not afraid of the dark healing rain is falling down healing rain is falling down healing rain I'm not afraid
every part of your body as you feel that power healing you praise him as you feel the power of the lord vibrating thank you jesus is any part of your body healing you praise him as you feel the healing power coming upon you praise him praise him as you feel the power the compassion of the lord going down your body praise him praise the living god a god is here healing every one of us a god the lord is healing us now we praise him jesus jesus praise you jesus thank you lord hallelujah 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 maybe this is some brother some of you you had a problem of your leg that pain of your leg the pain of the knee joint the lord has taken away you can feel it so clearly so so we got this healing come forward take a step forward come to the presence of god you had a problem of your leg that problem of your leg the lord has taken away you can feel that vibration you can feel that pain is being taken away the pain and stiffness of the knee joint the lord has taken it away so so we can feel it come forward come forward to praise and thank the lord to proclaim what god has done for you the saba and the praise of god the saba and the praise of god for what god is doing for what god is doing for every one of us let's praise and thank our god thank you let us rejoice thank you let's rejoice in what god is doing in the lives of our sisters and brothers let's praise him let's believe in his power the lord's power is manifested the lord's power is manifested in the healings of my of our brother of our sister let's praise him and thank him some of you had a problem of your eyes even this morning you had a pain for your eyes and that pain the lord has taken away you can feel that so so we got this healing come forward come forward to the presence of our god to trust in him to bear witness to him to serve him we want to come forward to the presence of god some of you had a problem of your shoulder you could not raise your arms up but now without any pain for able to raise your arms up shake your arms and shoulder if you can testify come forward come forward to praise and thank the lord we want to believe what god is doing for us god's power and saba hands and praise the lord believing in god's power rejoicing in what god is doing for us rejoicing 
in the presence of our God. Some of you had a problem with your fingers. You could not fold your fingers. You could not straighten up your fingers. Your fingers are made free, are healed by the Lord. So so we've got this healing come forward. Come forward to praise, to praise and thank the Lord. Some of you had a problem of your back, an acute backache. That backache, the Lord has taken away. You can feel that so clearly. Move, bend forward and see. Your back, your back, the Lord has healed. And those of you who got this healing, those of you who recognize this healing, come forward. Come forward to praise, to praise and thank our God. Some of you have a problem of arthritis, a stiffness and pain of the joint. You felt God's power going down your joint. And that pain of arthritis, the Lord has taken away. Those of you who got this healing, come forward. We want to come forward. We want to become witnesses to what God is doing for us, doing in our lives. We want to praise Him. We want to thank Him. We want to rejoice for having found the compassion of our God, for having experienced the power of our God. So so we've got any other healing, any other healing, come forward. Come forward to praise, to praise and thank the Lord. So so we've got any other healing, come forward. Come forward to praise. And thank our God. Hallelujah. 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 Praise you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. You are our Savior. You are our healer. You are our Lord. We believe in your power. In your mercy, Lord Jesus. We trust. We trust the God. Jesus, we praise you. We believe Jesus, praise you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus, praise you, Lord. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. The soul kneel down and receive the blessing of the Lord. The soul kneel down. As you kneel down, you will realize the healing power that is flowed into your joints, into your back. And we want to become witnesses to Him. To the ends of the earth. Let us sing together. Worshipping the Lord. Adoring Him. And receive the blessing of our God. Oh, sir. 